hey, you feel like building a Chevy K truck? Well, I know I do. So in this video, I'm gonna get back on Goldie. We're starting with a blank slate. All it is is frame, cab, front clip, and that's really it. But other than that, we're doing everything. So I got my donor vehicle parked on the side of the house, which is an 84 Chevy K10 that used to be my crawler, but I'm taking all the drivetrain out and swapping it in here, which includes an LS1 and a Turbo 400. So in this video series, we're gonna do all of that. But in this video, we're gonna get the donor vehicle over here. We're gonna start moving some stuff over. We're just gonna make it happen. Gates are open. You know what that means? Square body time. How to put some ATF in here first. All right, guys, I ain't started the truck in six months, so let's see what happens here. I right, gave it a minute. Let's see what happens. We may need to throttle the gas a little bit, though. All right, let me get it here. All right, let's see. Yeah, there we go, baby. Alright guys, let's talk here. So I got these suckers up off the K10. I ended up having to trim them out um, so that they would fit over here. So if you can see here, so they, they mount right here and then this was getting in the way. But I do like this hitch.
Thanks for rolling with me on this square body build. If you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Become a part of the Dick's 4x4 Garage family. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And as always, guys, you guys take it easy. Join me on the next one where we're going to put some disc brakes on here. So anyways, building them on the cheap. See ya.